Uh, the Article 5 Convention of the States is the beginning of the process in which state legislators can reassert the constitutional power and become, in effect, the kind of check on the federal government that the founders originally wanted the checks and balances to be in the federal government. However, anybody who's been paying attention understands that the federal government is out of control. K Street lobbyists run Washington. There's no check and balance there. Presidential overreach, both 44 and 45. There's enough to dislike on both sides of the aisle there. Presidential overreach with their uh, executive orders. What this does is this gives the legislature in each state the power that it was meant to have. Now, all this um, other uh, subterfuge of runaway conventions, just go read it. That's all you got to do. As you read it and you see it is very limited in its scope. It is very limited in its uh, ability. And, and there is no ability within the law, because this is what we're here for, the law, right? There's no ability within the Article 5 convention for a runaway convention. It's just nonsense that's thrown out there to try and dissuade people from the idea of something that the Founding Fathers put into place because they realized that their checks and balances at one time could possibly um, come off the rails. So I, uh, I urge you to support an Article 5 uh, convention. Sign the petition at cosaction.com and get as many of your friends and family to do the same. With your full address, your state legislators will know that you really are their constituents in their district. Our success depends on you. So we're inviting you to be part of history. Let's invoke the constitutional solution that's as big as the problem.